and welcome to Extra Utilities Part 2. Now, um, in the uh, history of uh, New Dimensions, there's been quite a few that have been added. Uh, I've had Limbo, uh, there's also this uh, this uh, Hellcow uh, dimension as well. Um, Limbo, of course, being from Dimensional Do Doors. Is that Crimson? And there's a few others besides. Of course, you've got the Mistcraft. Um, got enhanced portals as well which is going to be covering soon i'm going to be covering soon but today i want to look at the deep dark okay so the deep dark is if we look here we can see if we type in deep dark you can see there's this block which is from x utilities portal to the deep dark okay um and yeah this is made with a uh, compressed cobblestone which is a, a part of the functionality of um let's just have a look at the recipe for it before i head into this dimension then um Let's do that briefly then. Okay. So if we look at uh, the deep dark, we can see. We can see what we need to get this block. Uh, see, so we need unstable ingots and the uh, triple compressed cobblestone, which is a uh, power of three, which is nice to remember. Uh, powers X, uh, powers of three. So yeah. Um, what I'm going to need though is I'm going to need some armor for this because this is quite a dangerous place. So let's um, just head into it first. I think we only need one block. Or is it three? Let's have a look. Can I get in with one? Can I jump on top of it? Hmm, maybe I need three then. Let's get three then. Because when I tried it originally, it did actually work with three. So I'm pretty sure this is going to work. Okay, so we'll just grab a second. Can we do it with two? No? Three then maybe. Hmm. Maybe I need some more. There we go. Not quite sure how it works. I think I clipped on the top face there. So yes, yeah, it's the deep dark new dimension. There's a lot of new dimensions coming out, which is very very cool. Um, and this dimension, I believe, has got double the amount of world ores. And also, not only has it got double the amount of world ores, it's also got. Um, uh, so I don't really want to die here. Now if we look at what we can see. Um, the biome last time was an extreme hill, so I don't think the biome is, is particularly relevant. Um, and yeah, we're going to need some armor though. So let's get some armor before we head into this, this hell pit. So we're going to go for the usual. Um, Let's just do it like this. Um, mm, let's just try it like this. I'll get the pickaxe um, improved. Um, okay. Should I do the sword? I'll do the sword as well, actually. Um, I could put fortune on it as well, maybe. I don't think this works anymore. Does it work? Yeah, it does. Okay. So we've got full armor. There's a, uh, remember, I've also done the uh, armor status there. I've done an episode on that, if you want to watch that through. So let's have a look what we've got here. So what we're going to do is we're going to make a staircase down to begin. Um, I've got a lot of torches here, so that's good. I've got to be careful. I'm on, a, I'm on quite a high level here. You seem to always spawn on a high level. We've got this unnamed block here, which I assume is something which is going to be added to the game soon. Does it actually do anything? Yeah, it crashes the game. Okay, let's get back into this then. Um, yeah, let's imagine there's a crash. So back in the new world, just be very, very careful here. Not too easy to be careful. I just need to get down, really. Problem is, I'm going to be dropping quite a few blocks here. Um, <clears throat> let's just get a jetpack quickly. Uh, I don't want to take the bedrock one. Ooh. Actually, I think the ethanol one is okay, though. 
Let me just check. Yeah, the ethanol one's fine. So let's just go straight down. But yeah, the bed the bedrock stuff I think might be a bit bugged at the moment as well. This is of course in 1.07 if you're watching this later. Um, I'm sure everything will be fine. Okay, so I've actually not come out of a bad spot here. No, I am still in peaceful mode. So I remember there's doubling of ores, but there's also very tough enemies down here. So here we are in this... In this... What? Wow. All right, let me get back there. All right, so I'm in the same place now. Stay creative. Can I even land on this ground? Let me just... Um, I want to get rid of that. That was a funny error, wasn't it? Um, so my stuff should actually be down here anyway. Can I even land on the ground there, I wonder? Who are these guys? Dryad? They're not from this mod. Let me just get some torches. What's going on here? It's very new, this stuff, so... I don't want to touch the ground, though. Let's turn that this difficulty to hard now, see what happens. And what is this? There was this thing. Maybe I can land on this. It might kill me anyway. That's a th oh, shit. What the fuck is going on here? Let me just get some... Can I sleep here? Let me see if I can sleep here. Beat? <laughs> no. I see. Interesting. What level am I on here? 83. I'm still really high up. Where are these guys even at? I can't tell they sound more like furious than normal. Okay, now this is a big structure, isn't it? Forty health, that's quite a lot of health. I'm pretty sure they don't have that much health normally. Can I actually land on this? Let me just give myself a sword. Alright, let me just try and do this then. Because I'm not quite sure what happened there. I think I... Ooh. Ooh, this is coming up soon, Blood Magic. Oh, you know something else is pretty cool? Not that. I'm sure that may be cool as well. There is there is a tool in... Um, in Rotary Craft, a creative tool. Uh, if I do tool here... Hmm. I wonder if it's the same thing. All right. Let's get my armor out then. Let's do this. Okay. And you know what? I think I'm just going to go with the uh, go with the sharpness sword and the full armor. Shops, well, shops nine, whatever. Here we go. So I can walk along this ground. It's not just going to kill me. All right, let's go back into this structure then. This structure is big. Let me go around it. Let's 
take out some enemies. I've done this for a while. Ooh. Yeah, I've been missing this sort of thing. Not quite. Nah, not quite. I swear the explosion radius has got less. You can configure that, I think, in, in... Is it? No, maybe you can't. I was thinking you could do it in Creeper Collateral, but I'm not sure if you can. Mm, not going too well at the moment. They're walking quite fast, but they don't seem to have a an effect on them. What have we got here? What type of Enderman is this? Oh. I'm dead. I'm dead. Too good at shooting these guys. All right. Yeah, you can't. I was thinking, can you eat when you're doing that? No. What's even lower than this? Is there anything? I mean, we're not exactly... There is stuff here. It's fairly standard terrain, I think. For at least uh, what I've noticed in these new packs that the terrain looks a lot like this is often these big um, ravines underground, very narrow. Um, if you watch my Whaler video that I produced a few days ago, uh, you'll see that as well. So there's these big uh, ravines here. Got some salt there. That's uh, Pam's Harvest Craft. I can't actually remember how I managed to do the, um, the C3 Whaler now. Oh well. Nice though. Anything lower? Mm, I'm going to be here all day. And I don't want to be here all day. So... Let's go back out here. And let's just do a little bit more flying through the uh, this area that we found up here. Okay. So this thing is, looks quite big. I wonder if there's anything at the top. That's a good idea. What's that? Magnum torch. Oh no. Just look like it. So there's just a lot of fairly similar looking rooms here. I'm never going to find these doors where the zombies are at. Because there's so many doors. But why are they why are they attacking? There's no villagers around. Oh, I but no, I don't think they should be attacking without villagers, should they? Yeah. Yeah, I mean, what? What the fuck? What's going here, canola seeds, strawberry from agriculture. That's cool. The builders want. Nice. What is that noise? That awesome. Yeah, that is a funky noise. That one. I have not heard that noise. 
I could go through all the orcs, I guess, and find out, but we'll see. I swear they're not even fucking here. This is so funky. Ah, uh, that's episode one, Division Sigil. Did an episode on that. HLSA, Death Bloom. Nice. Man, I must have been just so briefly missing them. Unless this is some other kind of effect. I wonder what it is. I think probably it is just below me, though. What else we got in these chests? Gear units. Ah, shaft unit. Cool. So it looks like this place is a real uh, haven for rotary craft stuff. And, of course, we've got biomes of plenty of stuff. We've seen. And what else did we pick up? Um, road car biomes, plenty of extra utilities. Aquaculture as well. We've got some stuff there. But I guess these are just linked with these. Um, um, no, this is quite small now. This used to be bigger. I wonder if there's a thing for this. This has got a name. Mm. I'm not sure if it's been added to that yet. It might have been. But anyway, I think I'm just going to leave it here. Um, there doesn't seem to be too much more here that I can really think of covering. Uh, I may, have, I may have missed something. I don't think I have. I think this is just this is just a cool sort of world with harder mobs, perhaps better drops uh, from the mobs. Uh, uh, yeah, we've obviously got some blood med. As long as the, reg uh, the regular uh, chest stuff. So we've got all the all the chest stuff. Maybe, maybe this is um, a kind of. Uh, congruent over the, all the different chests, even if I was in a mine shop. I, I haven't researched it enough yet. I haven't looked into that enough yet. Um, but that may be the case. That may be the case. Um, yeah. Anyway, that's that's it for um, episode two. So thanks for watching.